All right, Coach, you guys head to Las Vegas for your first games of the year. How was the fall, and then how are you guys looking heading into your first first few games? Everything's looking great. Uh, you know, our kids are working really hard. We have a good mixture of returning players along with some talented younger players that are going to step up and play like they're capable of. But uh, we're excited. I know the fall went fast, and the spring is you know, faster so far. So, personally, for you, I mean, just your first year here doing all this, just kind of talk about how it's been going for you so far. It's been great. You know, I mean, a large part of that is, is the kids that we have on the team. You know, those are the kids that I spend the most time with, and they've been just awesome, you know, working hard, uh, super coachable. They're buying in and doing everything that a coach could ask. So uh, they've made my life easier. Uh, obviously, the community support that, that follows softball is huge, and the administration that you're at WT has been phenomenal. So uh, I just early on, watching what you've got, you got personnel-wise. <clears throat> what do you think is kind of going to be a big strength for you guys going into the beginning of the season? Well, I think we have a, a good combination of some talented returning players along with some talented younger kids. Uh, we don't have any juniors in our in our program at, at this point, so it, it's uh, a little bit of an age gap, but uh, it can be a good thing. You know, like I said, talented younger players and, and some older players that have some good experience and are doing a phenomenal job of leading us. Uh, Coach, uh, I mean, you just hit on it kind of, but you have four seniors on the team, and eight freshmen, no juniors, a couple sophomores. I mean, how do you make a team work, especially when they're so young and you have so few returning players in terms of the leadership? Yeah, I mean, like I said, I feel like I just got super lucky and blessed to, to have the returning players that I've had, and, and there's even some sophomores that even though they've only been here for a year have done a really good job of, of helping lead us. Uh, and just the work ethic is probably the biggest thing. You know, I think we're a team that we're going to keep getting stronger all season. Uh, and, and I think that that will be our our strength as the year goes on. We're just going to keep getting better because of our youth and because of the returning players' leadership. How big of a role will these freshmen be playing? I think, I think some of them will be playing a pretty important role. You know, I mean, I think in the game of softball, it's a little bit different than some other sports where you can kind of pick who you get the ball to. And, and uh, in the game of softball, you just got to be ready. They're all nine players have to be ready. And you just never know when fate's going to tap you on the shoulder and, and say, hey, it's, it's your turn to get the job done. So you said buy-in. I mean, so what, what's going to be kind of different from you from the, the previous coaches that have been here at WT? You know, for me, the buy-in piece really is just about work ethic. You know, just showing up to practice, having fun, being excited to show up every single day. I, I love what I do. I love showing up for practice. And, and to me, it's just it's fun to have kids there that, you know, we've done a lot of teaching and a lot of things that I think are really going to help us out as, as the season comes along with game planning and different things like that. And uh, just, just be, being all in on whatever we ask them to do. Who are some newcomers that uh, we should keep our eye on? Man, I feel like all the newcomers at this point, it's just so hard because we haven't played yet, you know? And uh, I feel like all of our newcomers are, are doing a phenomenal job, and I feel like each of them kind of have their role that they play. And uh, again, in the game of softball, it just kind of depends on fate and who decides it's going to be their day today.